Hey, what's up, guys? This is Eo Speaks back again with another video. So I wanted to talk about the recent debate that's been going on from last week to this week as regards to the recent news of Julian Edelman retirement. And the whole debate is Julian Edelman is a Hall of Famer. Now, I remember they did have this debate a couple of years ago, I think around 2019, around the time that uh, Tom Brady and them had won a Super Bowl. And Julian Edelman was the Super Bowl MVP because Tom Brady had an awful performance in that Super Bowl that really doesn't get talked about. But that's a conversation for another day. But as regards to this situation, um, when I, when it comes to the whole debate on is he a Hall of Famer, is he not a Hall of Famer? To be honest, this is, this is like this whole discussion is just like foolish and laughable to me. The obvious answer is no, Julian Edelman is not a Hall of Famer. And even Patriot fans, some Patriot fans will say that he's not a Hall of Famer. I could go into the whole minutia of why he's not a Hall of Famer, but his stats uh, speak for themselves. He has 6,000 plus uh, yards, 600 plus receptions. He only has 36 touchdowns for his career, and he averaged over 11 yards a season. Like those numbers right there, if if it wasn't if he didn't play for New England and he played for another team and he had no super rings or that MVP, like this conversation would not even this would have been an afterthought. If you have to have a debate on whether or not you're a Hall of Famer, then it's obvious that you're not a Hall of Famer. When people's names comes up like Randy Moss, Rice, or Chris Carter, or like other people like Terrell Owens is is an automatic, oh yeah, boom, he's a Hall of Famer no debate no end of discussion now with the whole to situation to the reason the whole to took a little bit of a while for him because of the shenanigans and off the field issues that he was dealing with while he was playing for the league and kind of rubbed the voters the wrong way so that's why they kind of took a little bit of a while to get him in the league but he was a first ballot hall of famer nonetheless because of his numbers and performance on the field and the impact that he brought to various teams even though he was a locker room cancer and all but when it comes to julian edelman no he's not a hall of famer there are many other great wide receivers that has way better numbers than julian edelman was a more impactful player than julian edelman and they're not in the hall of fame so why why would they even change the rule just for Julian Edelman to be in the Hall of Fame? I'm not saying Julian Edelman is a scrub or he's garbage or a bad player. He's a good player. He's not great. If he's if it's a Patriot Hall of Fame or a Patriot Ringer honor, sure, I have no problem with that. But when it comes to the NFL Pro Football Hall of Fame, no way. He 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 should not even be able to sniff the Pro Football Hall of Fame. No way. Not first ballot anyway. If they want to do it like. 10, 20, 30 years later. Yeah, sure, maybe, but no way. He's not a Hall of Famer. There are so many guys that's deserved of him. He's not even the best slot receiver within the past 10 years that he or 12 years that he ever played. So I don't get why this is even a discussion. There's people that's homing, that's, that's a homer for him to like make him an MVP, but I just don't see it. Um, those are my thoughts and opinions on the matter as regards to this topic of debate. But again, Julian Edelman is a not a Hall of Famer. Good player, not great, worthy of Hall of Fame aspiration. Sorry, but those are my opinions. Let me know yours down in the comment section down below. This is Ido Speaks, out.